Hey, 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 everybody, this is Greens, and I wanted to bring you a quick video update and let you guys know what's going on lately. Um, first of all, thank you everyone that subscribed to the channel and left your feedback. You guys are amazing. Um, and as far as the update goes, I just kind of wanted to make this quick video to let you guys know what's going on with me lately. Um, I've been having some trouble with uploading videos to YouTube, so that's why Yoshi Part 2 is not up yet. Um, I've been trying to upload the video for literally the last four or five days now, and every time I've uploaded it or gotten close to uploading and being done, it's failed or given me some kind of an error. So, sorry. <laughs> Um, but right now, I'm actually uploading it again through my um, video editing software, and I'm hoping that by doing that, maybe it'll bypass any kind of issues I'm having, and maybe this will be the best way to do it. Um, I'm also going to try to keep the videos to around 15 to 20 minutes max. Uh, I'm not sure if you guys like the longer videos or the shorter videos, but go ahead and feel free to comment on that and let me know. Um, but anyway, yeah, I've been having some trouble with uploading the, uh, the videos to YouTube, and also, I'm currently enrolled in three classes, um, summer classes right now, at my community college. Um, so that's been taking up a lot of my time as well. So anyway, I'm trying to be the responsible student here and still, you know, still get some good content up for you guys. <laughs> anyway, today was a very exciting day though. Um, so I want to share with you guys some things that I picked up. And today I found a garage sale. This guy was selling literally an endless amount of video games. Uh, there was everything from Nintendo, Super Nintendo, there was Genesis, uh, there was some Jaguar games, uh, there were some Atari games, and he was selling it dirt cheap. He was literally selling the Atari games for about 25 cents a piece, uh, the Nintendo games for about 50 cents a piece, uh, the Super and 64 and Dreamcast games, all those were about a dollar a piece, uh, but I picked up quite a lot of games, and it was very exciting. Um, now, I I have everything kind of put away right now, and everything's at least in somewhat organized manner, and I, I, it would just be too much to, to try to pull out and show you every single game that I got today. Uh, but I'm going to, if, if you guys would like, I'm going to take you on a quick tour and show you guys what I got today, um, and give you a quick, quick run-by. So we'll go ahead and we're going to switch over to first-person mode right now in 3, 2, 1... Alrighty, and here we are guys. Um, I just want to kind of quickly show you the games that I found today um, at the garage sale. And just keep in mind, I haven't, I haven't played any of these games yet. I'm pretty excited to check them out and see what they're all about. Uh, but we'll go ahead and get started here. Um, so for the Sega Saturn, I was able to find Virtual Fighter 2, Resurrection, Rise 2, Grid Runner, Revolution Revolution and next to these I was able to find some Sega Genesis games um, I was able to find Wanted, Dead or Alive, Bonanza Brothers Urban Strike The Incredible Hulk Sonic Spinball Kid Chameleon Toe Jam and Earl Altered Beast Predator 2 and Tasmania. And Tasmania actually is a game that I've played before. Um, it is pretty fun and you know why not? I picked it up, huh? <laughs> Alright, so these are a couple of the finds I uh, found today. <laughs> um, and the majority of what I found today was actually on the Nintendo. And I'm gonna show you guys what I found today and I'm not gonna read all the titles. Um, there is a, a crap a crap load. <laughs> um, but yeah, so I'll show you, I'll show that to you guys now. And I was running out of room on my video game shelf, so these are all the games that I found for Nintendo today. Um, not sure if this is too dark or not, but some of the titles are uh, Dungeon Magic, Sky Shark, Air Fortress, Rambo, Silver Surfer. Um, Platoon, Dragon Power, Archon, um, Mechanized Attacks, Defender 2, uh, Cobra Triangle, uh, Airwolf, uh, Tetris 2, 
uh, battle chess, which I was <laughs> super happy to find. In that game, you uh, play chess uh, against a computer or someone else, and the chess pieces are actually animated, which is really, really fun to watch. Watch some you know, real-life people duking it out. Um, I found Iron Tank, Ninja Gaiden 2, um, Legend of the Wizard, and a bunch of other ones as well. So this is this is the overflow collection so far and over here is my very very small bookshelf which is currently holding um, most of my games uh, up here I have Super Nintendo games on the bottom and Super Nintendo games on the top and in the middle <laughs> I had to squeeze in some extra titles that I found um, there's a Jaguar game that I've, I've had for a while actually since I uh, first got the Jaguar um, I found uh, what is it I found some Atari games right there Missile Command, Sky Jinx, The Empire Strikes Back uh, I found a Coleco version of Donkey Kong um, and to the left um, there are two Sega Dreamcast games I found today I believe one is Sonic and the other one is called Blue Stinger um, I now have three <laughs> Dreamcast games, so I'm pretty excited about that. Um, let's see. I was uh, also able to find... Uh, let's see here. I have a Game Genie and a code book for Original Nintendo. Um, I actually already had the Game Genie for Original Nintendo, and I just really wanted the code book. Uh, but the guy was selling this, and he said, you know, two bucks for, for both items. So I said, oh, sure, you know, why not? Sounds good. So that's that. Um, I was able to pick up the Power Glove, um, so that was pretty exciting. I've, I've wanted one of these for a long time, um, so I was happy to find that. And here are two games for it, Super Glove Ball and Bad Street Brawler. So I'm excited to check those out. Um, here's some 64 games. Uh, today, I believe I was able to find maybe two, uh, a game called Hexen, which is actually a lot like Doom. I played it a little bit. Um, you move, you run r ridiculously fast, and it's pretty much the same kind of game as Doom. Uh, I was able to find the first Turok, so now I have Turok 1 and 2. Uh, those were the finds from today. Um, and as you can see, there's some more stuff here. I got... Xbox and Xbox 360 on the left and down below and down here um, is more of the overflow of Nintendo games I've had these previously uh, but today I was able to find a few titles Dirty Harry, Metal Gear I've had already um, these are games actually I already owned um, but yeah there's some more Nintendo games down there so anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed the uh, quick run through there of all the games that I found today. Um, I know I'm a little bit of a hoarder, but hey, it's cool. Um, I like the retro stuff and I was very happy to pick up the, uh, the lot of video games that I, I was able to find today. Uh, so super exciting and uh, it's all going to be content for you guys. So check it out, check out the videos coming up. Uh, and again, if uh, you haven't subscribed yet uh, and you're into this kind of stuff, definitely subscribe to the channel, check it out. Um, I'm going to be posting a lot more content as soon as I'm able to upload videos to YouTube again, which should hopefully be very soon. I am currently trying right now. But anyway, guys, thanks for checking out the video, and I'll catch you guys later.